Hello and welcome to our Nativity 2020. Different in so many ways, especially as you're watching this on YouTube. Our crib services here at Gurner Church are always full of fun, craziness, laughter and love. And despite all the challenges that we have faced this year, all the sadness and fear that may be still around, I can confidently say that there is still love. Love amongst family and friends, love around our community, and love in this church. And that's what we need to hold on to and to remember. Love always wins. I'm delighted to invite you now to watch our first song called Just That, Love Wins, recorded a few years ago in a beautiful church in the southwest of the country. So let's start this special story and meet all the characters who were there and Jill will be able to join in the songs as we journey along. So are you ready? I didn't hear you. Are you ready? Okay, let's begin. So 
So welcome to our Christmas story. We retell it every year, how God came from heaven's glory, came to make his home right here. Jesus lying in a manger, born in all our mess and fuss, made us friends who once were strangers, son of God who lives with us. Soon we'll meet the shepherds, wise men, all the, Christmas, all the usual Christmas crew, and perhaps another story, one that's now involving you. In our world of joy and darkness, in our laughter, pain and care, Jesus came so we could know that God is with us everywhere. So our story starts, as always, with an angel, Gabriel, visiting the home of Mary, was she busy? Who can tell? All today I'm cooking, sweeping, feed the chickens, knead the dough. Honestly, it's never ending. Time to sit down for a night. But as soon as Mary rested, someone knocked upon her door. Grumpily, she went to answer not expecting what she saw. Greetings, Mary, highly favoured. I come to you from God with a message straight from heaven. Oh, you look a little odd. Yes, I realise you're frightened. It seems to happen quite a lot. People see the wings and halo, gives them a nasty shock. Would you like a glass of water? Do sit down, dear, there's a love. That's much better. Here's the message I brought from God above. <clears throat> Gabriel explained to Mary... God had chosen her to be mother of a special baby, God's gift for humanity. Honey, I don't want to seem ungrateful, but there's just one tiny thing. I should mention, just in passing, see my hand, no wedding ring. Mary, don't get all Beyonce, it's okay. The child would be not the son of your fiancé, but of God, the one in three. Father God will send his spirit and become the Holy Son, so the child you'll bear will be the Son of God, the three in one. Wow, that's quite a thing you're asking. God himself will come to stay. But I am the Lord's servant. Let it happen as you say. So the angel bowed and left her. Mary sat and drank some tea. Called up her fiancé Joseph. What would his reaction be? Right across the town from Mary, Joseph had a woodwork shop. He was busy making benches when a phone call made him stop. Joseph here, all tables mended, doors and windows, fences to carpenter to all of Nazareth. Who's there? Mary? Oh, it's you. Joseph, dear, I... Got any, I've news to tell you. We're going to have a child. God's own son, an angel told me. Now please, Joseph, don't get wild. Mary, this is disappointing. Not that I am mad or cross, but I must do what is righteous. Sorry, but the wedding's off. Joseph planned to do this quietly, caring still for Mary's plight. Gabriel had news for Joseph in a dream that very night. Joseph, son of David, listen. You are frightened, that's okay. It's all right to marry Mary. You'll still have your wedding day. Mary said the babe she's bearing is from God and that is right. Call him Jesus, which means saviour. He will be this dark world's light. Joseph made it up with Mary and they set a wedding day. But before they picked the bridesmaids, Something happened. A. Oh, they. Mary, I've just got this letter. Not good news because it's from them, you know, the Romans. About our taxes. Time to pay in Bethlehem. What? You mean I've got to travel while I'm pregnant? That's too hard. Can't we pay by direct debit, visa, pay, or MasterCard? Sorry, sweetie, not invented. It is bitterly and bust. Put your feet up. 
comfy footwear. That's a must. So Mary and Joseph started their long journey to Bethlehem. And Mary is often thought of travelling on a donkey. So we're now going to sing Little Donkey. So to Bethlehem they travelled, because of Joseph's family tree. Walked for days and days to get there. Were they tired? Guess we'll see. Nearly there now, Mary darling. Won't be long till supper time. We can stay with Bob, my uncle. In his guest room, you'll be fine. I really hope so, Joseph dear. This baby's nearly on its way. When we get there, call the midwife. I think you'll be a dad today. Uncle Bob had, Bob had made it lovely, but the room was very small. Mary much preferred it downstairs, just beside the donkey stall. So that night, as stars were twinkling, Mary's tiny babe was born. Joseph filled the donkey's trough with hay and blankets, soft and warm. Can I hold him? Will he call me dad? Oh, God's own ju- sand is wet as nappy. Mary dear, you're looking sad. I was thinking, will he be a carpenter like you, you echo? Making chairs and tables, or does something di very different back on? Will he grow to be like you, or, or will he take his father's job? Nestling in your arms, I see the face of human soul of God. As they gazed in awe and wonder at their baby's sleeping sound, silently beyond their vision, all of heaven gathered round. God no longer just in glory, but right here where human dwell. God made flesh to be God with us, Jesus our Emmanuel. We're now going to sing Away in a Manger, remembering the simple stable that Jesus was born in. Oh 
Meanwhile, on a distant hillside, shepherds sat there tending sheep. Amos, Seth, apprentice Colin, round the campfire, half asleep. Suddenly, at once, they heard some singing, saw a brilliant shining light. Gabriel arrived in glory. What a terrifying sight. What the flipping heck is happening? Seth and Colin, wake up now. Aliens, or I think Martians. Don't look at them, hit the ground. Sorry, I didn't mean to scare you. It's the halo, I suppose. But I have some information. Excuse me while I strike a pose. Uh, do not fear, I bring down tidings. News of joy for all the earth. News about a special baby. News about a new king's birth. Get up off the ground there, Amos. There's no need to hide your face. Martians, it's a blooming angel, not some dude from outer space. Look, there's loads now. Glor singing, glory, glory to be God on high. Peace on earth to everybody. Angels filling all the sky. Hurry now to David's city, Bethlehem and you will see. Wrapped in cloth and in a manger, Lord of all eternity. Get a move on then, don't just stand there gawping. So the shepherds left the hillside and just off the city square found the house with Mary Joseph and the baby lying there. Ain't he lovely? Who'd have thought it? Me, old Amos, standing here, right before the Lord of Glory. Makes my knees come over queer. Feel I should have bought a present. Could not think of what to bring. What could shepherds give a baby? Lord of Lord, King of Kings. I brought wool for him to sleep on. Comfier than straw and hay. Smells of sheep I know. But is this is the from the heart. Is that okay? So the shepherds knelt and worshipped, looking down. Phil feet on earth and eyes on heaven. Jesus slept and snuggled softly on the wool that they had given. Sure it had no fancy wrapping, ribbons, none, nor sparkly bow, but the gift they gave to Jesus came with love instead of show. So as Colin, Seth and Amos went back to their dozing sheep, Jesus somehow went there with them, giving presents they could keep. We're now going to sing our next song about those shepherds on the hillsides. Well, shepherds watch. While shepherds watched their flocks by night, all seated on the ground, the angel of the Lord Later on, a group of wise men travelled in from lands afar. Scientists, we'd call them these days, following a bright new star. 
Are we nearly there yet, Gaspar? We've been travelling for weeks. Can you just remind me what it is, why we've come and what it is that we seek? Melchior, have you forgotten? Honestly, you noodle brain. We bring gifts to greet and welcome, celebrate a new king's reign. All our books and all our wisdom told us that this star so bright means that king and God and saviour will be born this very night. When the wise men stopped their journey, what they found was quite a shock. Mary, Joseph, babe in manger, shepherds outside with their flock. Can I check this is the right place? Gold, I, I brought gold to crown a king. But where's the palace? Is this manger quite the thing? I brought incense, pure and holy, made to worship God on high. Is this baby weak and helpless, mighty God with human cry? I brought myrrh, which symbolises one who dies to save us all. Seems a strange gift for a baby, job too big for one so small. So the wise men gave their presents. Though they did not understand how the child who lay before them would one day give this command. Follow me, he'd call to many, preach good news in all he said. Heal the sick and free the captives, would they follow where they led? Gave his life to pay our ransom, brought us all a costly price. Righteous king and God and saviour, perfect lamb as sacrifice. So the wise men knelt around him, gave their costly presents. Then suddenly they knew that they'd been taking treasure home with them. Richer than the purest incense, costlier than gold or myrrh, wise men took home truest wisdom, prince of peace and comforter. So let's sing about those great wise men by singing We Three Kings. Now our story is almost ended. Everyone has met him here. Will you take the Christmas baby home with you throughout the year? Let us hear from all the people who have met with God today. How will this affect their stories? Will this change them? Who can say? Strangest night, but stranger morning, joy and sadness like a sword. When I kiss my baby's forehead, I believe I kiss my Lord. Though I'm his adopted father, I will raise him as my son. Teach him all I know and love him. Serve my king till kingdom come. I don't really understand it, all the stuff the angels said. But I know I knelt and worshipped by the Lord's, by the Lord's almighty bed. Why will God come down to shepherds, poorest folk of all the poor? Live with us and make us worthy. I desire that I adore. What have I to give to Jesus? Nothing but yet everything. 
all my heart and soul and worship for the baby, God and King. Gold I brought, expects from royals, majesty I found instead, higher kings and all kings ever, lying in a manger bed. I brought incense made for worship, rising as a prayer to heaven. Prayers now answered by the baby, God's own gift to me is given. Myrrh I brought, not understanding how this babe would die and live, bringing life in all its fullness, gifts that only he could give. So God's plan before creation, earth and heaven and heaven on earth, came in form of a gentle baby, mighty God in human birth. Now Emmanuel is with us. Christmas is forever true. In your home, if you'll invite him, God with you and you and you. God on earth and God in heaven, God with every human heart, greatest gift their heir was given, we and God no more apart. Shout, Shout out, out with us the Christmas story, let, let all heaven and earth declare, Jesus came to earth from glory, God, God is with us everywhere. Round of applause for our great nativity stars. Thank you, everyone. When I say, Holy God, please say, hear our prayer. Holy God, hear our prayer. Father, this holy night, there was no room for your son in the inn. We give you thanks for our family, our friends and our homes. We think of those who have no homes, all those who live in poverty and all those who are alone this Christmas. Holy God, hear our prayer. This holy night, Jesus came as a light shining in the darkness. Bring comfort to all who are in pain or who are sad in our community and in the world. Holy God, hear our prayer. This holy night, the angel sang, peace to God's people on earth. Thank you, God, for your son who offers peace and love to all. We pray for people who are living in countries where there is no peace. Holy God, hear our prayer. This holy night, Christians the world over celebrate Christ's birth. Open our hearts that he may be born in us today. Holy God, hear our prayer. We lift these and all of our prayers together in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you again for tuning in to our virtual nativity. Keep safe, keep well, and we look forward to seeing you all again soon. This Christmas, may you have the joy of the angels, the wonder of the shepherds, and the giving hearts of the wise men, and the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be with yours and those you love this day and always. Amen. We're going to end by listening to some of our local school children sing Merry Christmas, everyone. So get up and have a dance while they're singing. Happy Christmas to you all. <laughs> <laughs>